Hey, there we go. It takes a good, uh, almost a solid minute before uh, the time I hit live before uh, it transfers over. How you doing, Scott? Jonathan's with us. How you doing, Jonathan? Welcome, welcome. How are you all doing? It's hump day. Hump day. We'll wait a little bit, see if we can get some people in the room. Jonathan or Scott, you've been on a roll, man, with all these jackpot wins. Have you played any lotto tickets? I would have got some scratchers for sure. Oh, damn. That's right. That's one of my favorite uh, Geico commercials with the camel walking through the office. Uh oh. Anybody know what day it is? Mike! Mike, 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 Mike. That's a funny one. They actually did a second one that they just did for YouTube. Geico Campbell, type this in later. Geico Campbell goes to the movies. That's really funny, too. So check that out. Jimmy Licari, welcome. How you doing? Let's wait a couple minutes so we can get some people in the room. Where's all the peeps? No, just lucky with silver. Hey, I'll take that. So, so I'm missing my deli job because I'm not there. I haven't been there, oh God, probably four or five weeks now. And, uh, you know, if I'm not there, I'm not searching for any silver. So, boy, that's just, that's killing me. But Silver Sacks, hey, there he is. How you doing? Thanks for stopping by. Silver Sacks was cleaning up on Saco Plata's auctions last night. He was cleaning up. So, so where do we stand? We got uh, got a few people in the room. Um, still waiting for some of the people to come in that are uh, that have donated. I haven't seen Mel yet. Mel's not here. Mel's up first. Silver Sacks, Wesley, D Dub, Firecrest, Scott Jarvey, and Nerd Analyst. That's what we have so far. So, 68, so $40 away from the second jackpot prize. Right now, so far, we just got the 19 24 piece dollar. So, that's the first jackpot prize. Got some nice toning right in the, uh, the halo, like a yellowish, goldish color. It's not really showing up. Not really showing up, but that's the first jackpot prize. Mel's here, finally. There you are, Mel. What's up? I'm saying, where's Mel? He's up first tonight. So I got a, a line of BS from my bank today from Chase. They apparently are telling me that they're not able to order any boxes of half dollars because there's a nationwide coin shortage. I said, huh? What? I said, what do you mean? Oh, yeah, we're, we're not able to get them. Nobody is. I said, well, I know somebody, Sakapata, and told him where he is. I said, he's a chase and he's getting boxes, no problem. I said, I go to a, one of my credit unions, they're getting me a box. Well, I don't know what to tell you. We're, was, is that updated? Because this is something new. Um, so they're saying nobody can get boxes a half dollar. So what a line of BS that was. First, they blamed the corona. They said, oh, well, we can't get it during the corona. You know, we can't get, you know, COVID. We can't get that during that. Now that that's starting to wind down and they're open again. Oh, there's a there's a nationwide coin shortage. Barbara Carbone. Hey, how you doing? Thanks for stopping by, Barbara. Long time no see. Long time no see. So to line up tonight. Um, so what I'm going to do, because right now they're saying they can't get any boxes and the other banks only getting me one box a week. I'm going to cut the show down to just a Wednesday night stream. So I'm just going to cut it down to one. Until, I guess, until... Until the, the lobbies open up. I'm having a real problem taking the half hours back. 
I think uh, Sakapata finally, uh, I think down by him, he said the coin machine finally opened up, and then even that's still only by appointment. But, uh, all right, so the lineup tonight, so what, so what we got? We got Mel's coin corner first, Silver Sacks, Wesley, batting cleanup is D Dub, fifth is Firecrest, sixth is Scott Jarvey, and so far, uh, seventh, we had Nerd Analyst. So we're forty dollars away from a second jackpot prize. So far, we just have that nineteen twenty-four piece dollar right there. And roll thirteen tonight is a silver reverse ender, right there. That's definitely silver. That's the only one that stuck out to me. They did stick out like a sore thumb. I mean. The color difference is just amazing. It's so easy to spot. So, so roll 13. Roll two, we have a buffalo. Um, what is that? Seven, then we have a mercury dime. 13 is the reverse uh, silver render. 14 is an Ngabi Rush Grease Streak era. Those are really cool. 20 is a buffalo nickel. 25 is a silver Washington quarter. 28 is a spinning horse die crack era. 33 is a silver Washington quarter. We got two silver quarters. And we have the 39 is a Mercury dime. 41 is the Arizona with the die, the die chip over the initials under the cactus. So we have that. And one, two, three, four, and 45 is another Buffalo. So we have 10 marked prizes that you can get from the bingo wheel. So whoever gets 13 is going to get get the uh the silver ender so we know there's silver in the box it's just a matter of how much mike's here hey mike thanks for stopping by mike mike's my brother he's got the silver bug now he's doing a couple boxes a half dollars a week he's in orlando coming back to new york soon it's early july he had to wait because of the covid but uh he's been getting a box of quarters trying to get those new quarters and the searching those half dollars he's had some good boxes but he's just doing it for himself. Hunter Busher's here. Hey, how you doing, Hunter? Thanks for stopping by. All right, so we're long enough into this that we're gonna do, we'll start the stream off with a giveaway. Let's give away a buffalo. We'll shuffle off the buffalo. Got a fresh tube of buffaloes. A 1936 buffalo. Okay. Well, that came in nice and clear. All right. So 30 seconds. We're going to use the random comment picker. So I hope everybody, Chris W here. Hey, how you doing? Long time no see, Chris. All right. So did everybody leave a comment? Let's see. Let me call up the video. And this is going to be for the close all those windows. Go to my channel. All right. All right. Comment video. We got 26 comments. I don't know how many are unique. Let's see. Share and copy. Come over here. Hit the random comment picker. Where is it? There it is. Random comment picker. Pop that pup, puppy in there. All right, filter out duplicates. So we got 21. All right, so we got 21 unique comments. This is for the Buffalo Nickel. Got to be in it to win it. If I call your name to say here. Max Selleck. Max, I think one on the last stream. Max, are you here? Max Selleck. Step Stacker's here. Hey, Step, how you doing? All right, so let's give Max 20 seconds. Coin Jeremy, hey, thanks for stopping by. Seeing a few new people in here. I don't think Coin Jeremy's here, been here before. So if you just stopped in, we got the 1924 Peace Dollar. That's the first prize tonight. We're 40 bucks away from a second jackpot prize. 
All right. So, all right. So he's not here. All right. So let's pick another name. Close all these windows. All right. Pick another winner. All right. Who's it going to be? Mike Steele. Da -da -da -da. Mike, are you here? Stay here. Mike was here earlier. Is he, are you still here, Mike? Just type in here, Mike, if you're here. And Mike gets 20 seconds. I'm here. Bam. Okay. I'll put that buffalo in your wallet. I know you got a wallet here down on the floor. Let me get that out. Where is Mike's wallet? I got to alphabetize these once again. These are the people that stop by occasionally or have disappeared. Where are you, Mike? Let's see. Some of these people haven't been here. Hunter Busher, you got a wallet. You got a buffalo in your in your wallet, uh, Hunter. I didn't even know that. You got a wallet. I don't know if you remembered that. Bear Beehurst, he's got a wallet. Barbara Severson, I haven't seen her in a while. Palm Beach Tent, he never came back. He was here when I first started. Mike, I don't see a wall. I know you got a wall. I'll put it on the side for you. And I'm not going to waste any more time on that. I'll find it later for you, Mike. So, okay. So let's get started. Let me close that out here. Let me charge my phone. Put that right there. All right, so again, the order um, is we got Mel. Mel for four rows, Silver Sacks for four rows. Wesley for four, D Dub for four, Firecrest for four, Scott Jarvie for four, and Nerd Analyst for eight. And that's where we stand right now. Sanka Plata in the house. What you doing, brother? Sanka Plata, what'd you think about that statement from Chase Bank? There is a na nationwide corn shortage. So you're not going to be able to get any rolls according to uh, Chase Bank. Nationwide coin shortage, Sanka Plata. How do you believe that or what? So we will see. So when you get them, did you get my text? Are you talking to me? Are you talking to me? Let me take a look. At, I don't know if he's talking to me. I don't think he's talking to me. Okay. All right. All right, so all right, so Mel's up first. He donated twenty dollars. Thank you, Mel. Mel's a regular. Check his auctions out. He does an auction every week. Uh, Mel got four rolls. He's going to get two numbers. We're going to write that down, and we're going to get started. Oh man, pull that in a little closer. All right. So here we go. First fall out of the night is flying out of the chute, almost on the floor. It is 25. 25 is a silver quarter. Bam! First ball out tonight. Silver quarter. Way to go, Mel. All right. Let me get a box for the coins. I gotta get a fancy box like uh, Saka Potter's got for my uh, entries. I gotta work on that. All right, so 25. Let me get the bottom roll. So Mel gets a silver quarter right off the bat. That's the way to start the night. Mel's gonna get a 1951 silver Washington quarter. I got ink on my hand here, showing right up in the lens. And that's marker. Okay, so Mel, you got that to start. Let me write down 25 for Mel. All right, one more for Mel. 
And three. Twenty-five and three, Mel. One, two, three. Easy as one, two, three. Okay. Four rows for Mel. Mel gets to play the card game. We take off that sticker. Get that off of there. Can we find Mel some silver? Besides, we got the silver quarter. Can we find some silver in the rolls? And then he gets to play the card game. And we have tonight, we have Dunbar on the top and String and Sons on the bottom. And it looks like all clad from here. But I check them all real quick. But last week, I think I missed two of them. But they don't have that silver edge. Saka Plata does a coin test. But I feel like I'm going to miss some if I do that. But he's really good at it. All right, nothing now. Let's do a string of suns. What's it say? I have to get the rest before it's too late. Mm -hmm. We'll see. Yes, the Chase said it was Saka Potter's fault because of the nationwide shortage because he bought them all. He bought all the rows. There is none left for anybody else. That's what Chase said. He said, blame Saka Potter. Seeing anything? A lot of clad. Very sad. All right, let's go back to Dunbar. Dun, da, dun, 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 Dunbar. All right. All right, got really shiny in the middle. Might just be a regular. I don't know if that's a anything in particular. We got a proof. We got a 2002 proof. Bam! That's nice. We got a 2002 proof for you, Mel. All right. That puppy stood right out. And I got a green one. Oh, that's lovely. So we got a proof for Mel. Mel's got the quarter and the proof. One more roll for Mel, and he gets to play the card game. He's got two entries. So far, we got the one jackpot prize, the 1924 piece dollar. All right, nothing interesting. Let me try that silver test like he does. I heard nothing. I'm going to check them all anyway. I don't trust myself. Half a row left. Nope. All right. Sorry, Mel. Just the proof. And we got the silver quarter for you. Now you get to play the card game. Mel, give me a number. Let me mix up the cards. One through eight, Mel. What's it going to be? One through eight. Give me a number, Mel. On deck is Silver Sacks. Nerdanos, hey Maximus, just tried my first corn roll hunt half stream. Only went through half a box before your stream. Found three NIFCs and a 65 and a Walker. Bam! That's what I'm talking about. Was it Johnny or Jimmy? So we send me a picture of the Walker. I'll put it up on the stream, Nerdanos, if you want. What year was the Walker? Very cool. Very cool. Hey, I don't think you're going to be able to get any more because Chase told me there's a nationwide shortage and nobody can get boxes at half dollars. And I think they must think I'm really stupid or something. I know I'm Polish, but, but uh, you know, come on now. All right. So, Mel, we're waiting on a number. 1945. Okay. Mel wants six. Four, five, six. One, two, three. Good luck. Benji. Bam! 
Bam! There we go. Benji in the house. Benji for Mel, silver quarter and a proof. Way to go, Mel. I think we started the last stream off uh, with a 90 percenter. All right. So let me write that down. Mel got a Benji. I'm trying to keep track of what everybody wins. Let me get you a Benji out. I got one laying right here. I got a new roll right there. We got a 1963 Philly. 63 Benji. The last year. Very nice. So Mel got that. We got the proof. And the silver quarter. And he's got the two entries, 25 and 3. Thank you, Mel. Mel, when you want your wallet mail, do you let me know? Very nice. All right, Silver Sax is up. What's Scott Jarvis saying? Sakapata says, Chase is actually right, Maximus. Check out the article. Got changed. There's a coin shortage because of the corona stopping the flow of physical currency. All right, well, you let me know if they actually say you can't get any boxes. All right. Because uh, my credit union didn't say that. They said we could get you a box a week. But maybe they didn't know. But we will see. I, you know, it just sounded very uh, suspicious, you know. All right. What's Step Stacker says? Polish lives matter. <laughs> no matter what. <laughs> Polish lives matter. That's right. That's right. Meathead was a Polak. And you got to be old if you know who Meathead is. Okay, Silver Sacks, you are up. You donated $20. You get two numbers. One in the shoot already. That makes it super easy. All right, number, number, number 23. Don Mattingly now betting for the New York Yankees. Don Mattingly, the hitman. Number 23. 21, 22, 23. 13 is the silver reverse ender. How much silver will we find in the box tonight? You'll never know. 23, one more. One more for Silver Sacks. Silver Sacks was cleaning up on Sakapata's auction the other night. Was that, was that last night? I'm trying to remember. Um, the days are blending together. 12. Oh, man, you just missed that silver ender. 13 is the silver ender. 23 and 12. All right. So you got four rolls for him. All right. 23 and number 12. Let's start with a string of the suns. So I'll see if the TEG can get me. My problem right now is nobody wants to take them back. They don't want to take them back. I didn't think they could refuse U.S. currency. All right, I don't see anything. Quickly, we will do the Sakapata silver test. I heard nothing, nothing that sticks out, but let me just check them all real quick. Somebody outside my door here is playing hip hop in their car. You must be thinking the whole neighborhood wants to hear it. Hmm. See anything that sticks out, but let me check them all. The Dunbar has been spitting out some silver that I was getting from Chase. They do have four boxes sitting there waiting for me to pick up, but nobody wants to take the coins back. And I don't have an endless supply of money to keep laying money out without being able to return them. That's another $2,000. How much did you return Sakapata when you finally got back to the bank there? I think he said they're uh, letting him return his coins uh, by appointment only. Oh, okay. Nerdano says send me a picture. I will show that after, after we do 
Silver Saxes Rolls. When we get done with that, if I can remember, and that's a long shot, I will show that picture. I'll call it up and show you his first walker that he found in a row. You got to keep it. You got to keep it separate from the other ones. I think I have mine right here. Here's mine. I'll show you mine real quick. I've shown this before, but if you haven't seen, my very first live stream was crazy around the middle of November last year. And I was waiting for a special box to stream because I wanted the first thing to be good. And I had no clue it was going to be like that. We found the 104, well, I found 140, 40 percenters. And this coin, which was uh, won by uh, Silver Nitrate, who was nice enough to return it to me. And he said, you should have that. Your first stream has a momentum. He even put it in a case for me, a 1900 Barber. That was found in my very first live stream. So very cool of him to do that. He returned it to me. So we found 140, 40 percenters and a 1900 Barber. That was insane. And he even sent me a little letter. I know I'm getting a little off track. Bear with me. And he goes, da, 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 da. what do you write on the bottom? He goes, what an amazing first coin roll hunt stream. I'm sending you back the 1900 Barber half dollar that you found in my rolls. I know I'd want to keep a metal like that. Congratulations, Silver Nitrate. So very cool that he sent that back. So. And I've only found one other barber, and it was the same year. It was a 1900. Shortly after that, those are the only barbers I've ever found in a coin roll hunt. Barbers are very hard to find. All right. Sorry. We're back to Silver Sacks. One more roll for Silver. For SS. All right. I think that's just dirty. Yeah, that's just a dirty one. I didn't want to get excited. Let me just check them all, though. I think I got a couple of donations. We'll check that out. But right after we do Silver Sacks, we're going to call up Nerd Analyst's uh, picture he sent me of that walker. I'll show you on my phone. All right, so Silver Sacks, 23 and 12. You get a card game. Let me mix up the cards. Give me a number one through eight. One through eight. Mix them up. One through eight. What's it going to be? What's it going to be B? Field Guide 316, thanks for stopping by. Welcome. He wants number five. Number five right here. Ready? One, two, three. Dime and a quarter. You got a Merc. You got a Freddie Mercury and a Washington quarter. Very nice. So you got a Washington quarter. And I got a Mercury dime right here. 1945 Merc. I got a focus. There we go. 1945 and a 63. 63 Washington quarter. All right. Thank you, Silver Sacks. He won uh, one of the giveaways. He's got that uh, one ounce cannabis round. That's in your wallet. Thank you, Silver Sacks. And you got your two entries. All right. Let me call that picture up. Hey, I didn't forget. Miracles do happen. All right, let me go to my email. Find that picture. There it is. Da, 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 da. Very nice. Oh, and a 65. Can I turn it sideways? So this is the very first coin hunt for Nerd Analyst, and that's what he found. Forty-five Walker and a sixty-five Kennedy. So we gotta love it. Free silver in the rolls. How, how can you, you can't go wrong? How can you go wrong? So very nice. Congratulations, Nerd Analyst, on those finds. Thanks for sharing with us. 
It's either Philly, either no mint mark, or two worn. I did not know. I'm still pretty a newbie with coins, and I did not know that the 1917 Walker has the mint mark on some of them on the front, some are on the back. Because I was going through eBay scrolling, and somebody said reverse, and somebody said obverse. I was like, and I guess the one on the back is worth more on the reverse. Okay, so let me see. Let me get caught up on the uh, donation, see where we are, see if we're at a second jackpot prize. I think we are. And let's see. Da, 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 da. Let me get that caught up. Next up is Wesley. Wesley, are you in the house, Wesley? Is Wesley here? Let's see. Da, 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 da. All right. Oh, we got a couple. Okay, we got, um, I, already, I already had Nerd Anos written down. We got Chris, uh, Chris came in with a 20. Thank you, Chris. And Jeremy, do you have a username? Coin Jeremy, okay. Hey, uh, Coin Jeremy, when you send it, though, try to send it. Wesley's here, okay, good. When you send it, send it. Uh, uh, let me get that focus, there we go. Send it friends and uh, family so that I don't have to pay those PayPal fees. So if you could, thank you. Appreciate it. Let me write you down. I got Chris down and Coin Jeremy. Now for $10, you don't get a uh, card game. You just get a Merc Dime. You got to donate 20 to get a card silver card game. So but for the $10, you get, you get a Mercury Dime. And we are ten dollars away from the second jackpot prize. All right, get that over here. Plug my phone in. And Wesley, you're up. Good luck, Wesley. Let me plug my phone in. We'll get going. All right, Wesley. Good luck. In the shoot, waiting. Didn't even have to mix it. Forty-five. Forty-five, Wesley. Focus, there we go. 45. 45 for Wesley. One, two, three, four. Buffalo! How low can you go? Buffalo. And how does Saka Potter say? A buffalo. Buffalo. I like this better. A 1935 Buffalo. All right, let me take the buffalo off. All right, let me write that down. 45, I did. One more for you, Wesley. 28. 28, 45, and 28. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, you got another one. You got the spinning horse die crack era. Wesley gets two prizes. Bam and bam. This is a really cool one. If you don't know what it is, let me take a picture of my phone. And let me show you real quick. Okay. Let's see if I can get a nice shot of that. If it's coming out, it's hard to see, but it's definitely there. There's a die crack from the mouth. The die crack from the mouth is going right through the A. Okay. So you get the spinning horse die crack area. You got the buffalo. So you won two prizes. Very cool. Now let's we'll see if we can find you some silver, Wesley. Let's start with the Dunbar. Dunbar has been producing the silver. All right. Uh, I don't see anything, but let me check them all. 
in there. Now, what else have we found that proof? We haven't found any silver in the rolls yet. We have that silver ender. Dunbar has been pretty... Sakapata, what have you been getting? You've been getting Dunbar or drinks? What kind of rolls have Chase been giving you down there? That's definitely all clad, but let me check them all. Anyway, I like to check them all. I hate to say that I missed one. No. You say it there? He's been getting drinks. Okay. Now he's been getting Dunbar. Dunbar's consistently had some, not a crazy amount. Um... A couple streams ago, I think we found 10 in the box, 10 40 percenters, about. I, nobody kept track, but it was at least around 10. And we, we found some in the last one. I think we found four or five. All right, I don't see anything in this one. But I like to check every coin. So I'm here in the restaurants up here. I'm in. Uh, I'm about an hour and a half north in Yankee Stadium, and I'm here in the restaurants around here. The end of next week are going to open up 50% capacity. Right now, the only way you can eat at a restaurant right now is um, they have tents set up in the parking lot. Fortunately, it's been cool enough where they could do that. Uh, not seeing anything. This one, I don't see any silver for you, Wesley. But you're going to get silver in the card game. That's a guarantee. All right. All right. Nothing there. Let me write down. Oh, silver sack's got a quarter quarter and a dime. I just want to keep track. Okay. Okay, Wesley, I need a number. One through eight. Let me mix up the cards. One through eight, Wesley. Give me a number. My parents still can't open their diner. Seven. Yes, if I find any NAF NAFCs, that goes in your wallet. You can either put them in your wallet and I can send them to you or use them as the 50 cents value that they are towards a trade up towards a better coin. So if you get enough of them, you can trade it for a dime or a quarter or even a half hour. So what did he say he wanted? Seven. Seven. There you go. Seven. Wesley, one, two, three, seven. Two silver quarters. Bam! That's a nice prize. Two silver quarters. Very nice. All right. Two silver quarters. You're going to get a 61 and a 64. And you got the buffalo and you got the spinning horse. Very nice. So two silver quarter, the buffalo, and the spinning horse. Thank you, Wesley. When anybody ever wants a wallet mail, you just let me know. Wesley, your wallet's getting pretty big. You got a nice wallet here, buddy. Wesley's got one of those bicentennial silver proof sets in there. I see that. That sticks out like brown. You can't even open your wallet. It's been a while, I guess. Very impressive. What do I see in here? I see walkers. I see. Kennedy half hour, silver quarters. Very nice. There's a American Silver Eagle. American Silver Eagle. Bicentennial Silver Proof Set. Very nice. All right. So two quarters. And numbers are 45 and 28. D Dub is up next. D Dub donated $20. D Dub in the house. D Dub's first number is 30. Number 30. Thirty. Thirty, thirty, twenty, thirty. Right there. Ugh. Wow. 
That's the only thing about doing it this way. It's hard to get your fingers in there. All right, so 30. Got that written down. One more for you. D dub here. D dub in the house. He's here. Okay. DoorDash says, very busy in New York or Newburgh right now. Well, just open your app and start making money. I've been doing DoorDash because, um, you know, like I said over and over, I'm not at my deli job because I can't wear a mask because of the, you know, cuts down on my breathing. Okay. And we got one more for D-Dub. Okay, Seth. 22. 22. 30 and 22. 21, 22. All right, good luck, D-Dub. Start with a string of sons. You never know. So, yeah, like I said, the problem is Chase said they got four boxes sitting there that they had ordered. But I said, don't return them. I said, I'll, I will pick them up eventually, but don't return them. But uh, the problem is I've got nowhere to return them. I may have to take a trip down to Sacapata's bank and, and use this account. <clears throat> Hint, hint. All right, deep dub. Let's see. Yeah, all clad in this roll. Nothing there. Nada. Let's do a Dunbar. Dunbar. So we are, what did I say? We're $10 away? Or let me check. 20, 40, Ten dollars away from a second jackpot prize. I think we'll get that. All right. Let's see anything in this one. Let me check every coin for you, buddy. All right. Nope. Nothing in that one. So far, just that proof in the rolls. Put my phone in my phone. I got to change my phones because I can't get to a store because all the stores are closed, and the battery needs to be replaced. It says your battery battery is severely depleted, so it's constantly charging. All right, back to Dunbar. No, nope, don't see anything in this one. You never know, though. Like Nerd Animals found a walker tonight. That's exciting. It took me a while to find my first one. First, it was finding a, a Kennedy, finding a silver Kennedy. Then it was a 64 Kennedy. And it was pretty much in order. Then I found a Benji and I said, all right, now I want more. Now I want a Walker. And it wasn't shortly after that that I got a Walker. I was doing coin roll hunting for myself for quite a while before I started streaming. I started back in last um, April with just quarters. And then I started getting half dollars by June. So from like June to November, I was just opening boxes for myself. Uh, I don't think so. Let me check them all. Alright. Nope. Sorry. Sorry, D-Dub. Didn't find anything. You get a card game. So give me a number. You mix up the cards. One through eight. Up next is Firecrest. What's the D Dub say? D Dub thirty and twenty-two. Yes. What's he saying? Got eight. Gotten eight of the dudes so far. Is anything on there? Me too. Let me check all my money. All right. D Dub says number three. All right. One, two, three. One, two, three. Dime and a quarter again. 
All right, there's only one of those. Dime and a quarter. All right, so you get a mercury and a silver quarter. All right, I got some. I got some lane right here. Okay, Is that one right there. Got that, and we got a. That is not a dime. What is that? That is a Canadian. How did that get in there? Boy, I hope I didn't get gypped because I bought a roll. They stick. They stuck that in there. Uh, 36, 36 Mercury. 36 Mercury and a 64 Silver Washington Quarter. All right, so thank you, D-Dub. I'll put that in your wallet. D-Dub's wallet's right here. If anybody wants their wallet mailed, you just let me know or email me. If I don't see it, hit me upside the head and mail me again until I do see it. All right, Firecrest is up. Firecrest donated 20. Good luck, Firecrest. We got one in the shoe for you already. Firecrest, your first number is 47. 47, Firecrest. Forty-seven. Let's see. 50, 49, 48, 47. Forty-seven. Got it written down. Okay, one more for you, Firecrest. All right, and forty-two. Boy, that comes out a lot. Forty-two. Mariano Rivera. Never see another one like him. Probably in our whole lifetime. Forty-two. Good luck, Firecrest. You got four rolls for you, then you get to play the silver card game. Let's start with the Dunbar. I don't see anything in this one. How much silver is in the box? You got the silver under. Gotta have some friends. All right, string and sons. Nope, don't no see anything in the string and sons. That one's really bright. What is that? Nope, just a 77. There are two more for you. Back to String and Sons. Yeah, bingo. Yeah, right? Yeah, I used to go play bingo with my mother. Um, gosh, she loved it when I went with her. I, I couldn't go. I had to stop because this was back when they still let them smoke. I couldn't take the smoke. OMG, do those old ladies like to smoke in that hall? It was just like a blue fog in the room. Worse than the bone alley. Man. That's why I had to quit bowling back in the 90s. I couldn't take the smoke. The smoke was just killing me. Local bowling alley here on Wednesdays, whenever they do open again, if they do it again, I don't know. Uh, Wednesdays from one to five, dollar a game for bowling. A dollar. Is that crazy or what? I went down by my son. He's in Charlottesville, Virginia, and they're an official AMF bowling alley, and they're charging $7 a game. Doesn't matter if you're a kid. There's no kid price. $7 a game. And shoe rentals are $5. So to bowl one game with tax was 20 bucks. Whoa. And no practice shots. All right. Nope. I don't see anything in this one. Let me check them all, though. We haven't even found an NIFC yet. Not yet. Good 
Is somebody going to get that silver render tonight? We don't know. All right, so Firecrest, you get a card game. Let me mix up the cards. Give me a number one through eight, Firecrest. Uh, number one through eight for Firecrest. Well, he said I bowled in a couple tournaments in Charlottesville, Virginia years back. Oh, cool. So for every 10, you get a ball, and for $20, you get a card game. So if you just donate 10, you get a Mercury Dime, but you don't get you don't get the um, card game. For $20, you get four rolls, two numbers towards the jackpot prize. We're $10 away from a second jackpot prize. And those numbers that I'm telling everybody, somebody's going to win a 1924 piece seller. That's how it works. The PayPal's in the description down below. M Steel. M is in Maximus. Steel1990 at gmail.com is my PayPal. Firecrest says, cool. Let me get four. Number four. Okay. Good luck, Firecrest. Number four. One, two, three. Dime and a buffalo. Okay. So where was the Benji and the Walker? Because somebody said they wanted to see where they are. Uh, da, 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 da. Walker was number six, and the Benji was number eight at that time. So what did I say? Dime and dime in a buffalo? Is that what I said? A buffalo. How low can you go? You're going to get a 22 Buffalo and a 20 Mercury Dime. All right. Thank you, Firecrest. I know you got a wallet here, so I took everybody's wallet out. <clears throat> right now in your wallet, you've got... Two silver quarters and two Merc dimes before this. And you got another Merc dime and a Buffalo. And he's got two entries towards the jackpot. Scott Jarvie's up, then Nerd Analyst. Uh, Chris, Chris is up, and then Coin Jeremy. All right, so Scott, you're up. Scott Jarvie, are you in the house? Good luck, Scott. Number 49, 49, Scott. Forty nine. Forty nine. They wrote it down, I did. Okay. Wow, flying out of the shoe. 31. 4931. Let's start. Let's start with the Dunbar. Wow. Man, is that tight. Seeing anything. Let me check them all though. Gotta find some silver in the rolls. Come on. All right, 
Matt String and Sons. What's Step Soccer saying? I haven't said that in 31 years. What did he say? What did Step Soccer say? I'm looking back through the chat. I don't see anything. I don't see what you said, Step Soccer. I see I haven't said that in 31 years. Nothing in this row. Two more rows. Bring in Suns again. Looks like all planned to me. Jeez Louise. Where are those coin collections? Nope. One last Dunbar. Scott's been on fire. Winning jackpot prizes. He won one of mine. He's won a couple on Santa Plata's. A really shiny one in the middle. I don't know if it's anything. The 2017 from Denver. He had our first NIFC of the night. Well, at first, I thought it was a proof, but now it's just a 2017, but that's an NIFC. That's the first NIFC, right? Okay, not seeing anything. Nope, 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 nope. All right. All right, sorry, Scott. Scott gets a card game. He donated $20. Number one through eight, Scott. A number from Scott up deck uh, on deck is Nerd Analyst. You're up. Fifteen in the chat. Let's get to fifteen likes. Yeah, come on, guys. If we get twenty-five likes, I give something away. All right, Scott. Wait, ninety-eight. Give me a number. Scott wants number four. One, two, three, four. Ready? One, two, three. Walker. Boom. Scott's luck continues. There it is. Walker. Johnny or Jimmy? What's it going to be? All right. I got two walkers right here. Oh, actually, I got a couple of loose ones over here. We'll go get these first. Last one in that roll is 1945. I don't see a mid mark. Really nice shape. Scott gets a walker. Just like the one Nerd Analyst found, a 45. Scott's getting a nice wallet right here. Congratulations, Scott. And you get the NIC. All right. Nerd Analyst, you're up. He donated $40. $40 from Nerd Analyst. All right, so he gets four numbers and four entries and eight rolls. Good luck, Nerd Analyst. 40. 40. Thirty nine and forty. Get that in there. Come on. All right, forty. That's one. He gets three more. 
Good luck, Nerd Annals. Again, 13 is the silver reverse ender. One, B1. One. That's two. All right, number three is 24, 24. 24, 41 and 24. Okay, and one more. Where are they? 26. 26, 21, 24, and 26. All right. So eight rolls, four entries, 41. 40, number one, 24, and 26. All right, let's start with a Dunbar. Still looking for the first silver besides the one that we have the silver render. I don't think so. Let me check them all. In there. Back and forth with String and Sons. All right. What's quest say? That elusive 13, yeah. I keep getting uh, people's messages over the chat. How far away from a second prize? We are $10 away from a second prize. That's, I mean, that's crazy, right? Somebody's not going to donate $10 to get that second jackpot prize. I haven't seen Clay 37 around. I've seen him in other chats. I don't know if he's working different hours, but he's been a regular. He has a massive wall also. So I'm in Taco Plata stream last night, so I know he's around. I think he's out more on the West Coast, because I mean, when I had my stream, he came in later. Step Stacker sent the $10. He goes, there. There's your second jackpot prize. Okay. Now we got to add a second prize. Which we will do right after this. Nothing there. Let's do a Dunbar. This is for Nerd Analyst. Okay. Nope. Let's pull that back a little. I can't 
keep hitting the wire. All right, three more. Can we find him some silver? Gotta be some silver in the box, I would think. Uh. Okay, nothing there. Two more rolls. So you donated forty dollars. You get two card games. You can do one times two or two separate pulls. So you could say one times two, and then give me a number. Nothing there. One last Dunbar roll. No, nope, don't say anything in this one. Wow. I'm shocked. There. Okay, so we didn't find anything. I'm sorry. He wants one game times two, number seven. I got to mix up the cards. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Number seven. Benji! Boom! Two Benjis. All right. That's what I'm talking about. Two Benjis. Let me write that down. Two Benjis. Scott, what'd you get? You got a uh, a walker, right? All right. Two Benjis. Right here. Very nice. Out of a roll. A 60 and a 63. Any mid marks? No, both from Philly. But you got a 63 and a 60. Two Benjis. Very nice. Yeah, that side was his wallet. Holy moly. Congratulations, Nardanos. The gamble paid off. All right, Chris, Chris, you're up, and then Coin Jeremy and Step Stacker, and that is all we have. I got to add a second, second jackpot prize, which I got right here from the Royal Canadian Mint in a holder, in a box, in a capsule. This is a 1984, 80, 100 years for Toronto. It's got a Indian in a canoe. This is a half, uh, half ounce silver. Proof half dollar 1984 Canadian in the capsule in the collector box comes in the nice box right there. And that's the other side, that's the second jackpot prize. Very, right, that's a beautiful coin. All right, that's the second jackpot prize. Thank you, Nerd Analyst. So, 40, number one, 24, and 26. Chris W is up. What does this say? Problem is, too many people in coin hunting is getting to the point where you won't find any silver. Yeah, you were basically we're relying on people dumping their collections, taking it to the bank, and just dumping it, or, or you know, or turning them in. Really, because I'm not sure how much more silver. Like the one I got that first stream when I found 140, 40 percenters. That was somebody's collection dump. There's not that much silver in it. I just got lucky enough to get somebody's collection dump. And the sister box had 72. So there was, what, 210, 40 percenters dumped. But every once in a while, that's it. An 80-year-old lady dumps a bunch of silver at the bank and it ends up at Maximus' house. Hey, that sounds okay to me. Except now we got a coin shortage. So who knows whether we're going to be able to get the coins or not. 
AB Silver's here. How you doing? Welcome. Haven't seen you in a while. Good to see you. If if I win that coin, can you please scrape the lizard queen off the other side before you ship it? No. That's up to you to do. You can do a stream on that. So, Chris W, are you in the house? You're up. Chris donated 20. Chris gets uh, two numbers. Good luck, Chris. Chris, number five. So number five. Is anybody going to get that silver roll? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. That's one. So number five for you, Chris. Chris is here. Okay, number five for you, Chris. And whoa, flying out of the shoe. Is it 33? 33. 33. Five and 33. He gets a silver quarter. Bam! Nice. He got one of the marked enders. Very nice. Okay, let me pull out a silver quarter for you. All right, where are the quarters? There they are. All right, Chris, you get a 1959. Gonna focus. All right, so you get a 59. You get four rolls. You get to play a silver card game, so you get guaranteed silver. There's a Benji, there's a Walker, there's quarters, there's dimes, there's combos. All right. Oh, this one's kind of auspicious. No, this is 72. Just a dirty 72. All right. Not seeing anything in this one. Bummer, bummer, bummer. We've only got a few more donators, so I don't know if we're going to get to that. Uh... There's a really nice toned 77. Wow, look at that. You want that, Chris? I mean, it's just clad, but look at the toning on that. If you want that, let me know. All right, nothing in that one. Chris, come on, let's find some silver tonight. I'm bumming out. Okay, nothing in that one. One more. So last stream we found, I think, five. In the stream before that, I think we found 10, 40 percenters. So I'm bumming out. We're not finding anything tonight. Can't find them every time.
All right. Sorry, we didn't find it. Did you want that? Um, did he say he wanted the? Um, I'll take it. Okay, good. Okay, he wants it. Yeah, that's some cool toning on that. And you got the Washington Quarter. Now you get a card game. Let me mix up the cards. Give me number one through eight. One through eight. What's going to be? It's going to be Chris. Give me a number. A number, number, number. One through eight. There's a Benji. There's a Walker. There's Silver Quarters. There's combos. Number three. One, two, three. Dime and a quarter. You get Benji, or not Benji, I'm sorry. You get a dime and a quarter. You get a Merc and a quarter. Dime and a quarter. Benji was the number three this time. Why not number three? I just pulled over number three. All right. And a 39. Okay. And a 48. A 48 Washington quarter. All right. And you got the toned. Tone to the bone. 77 half. Got some serious toning on the front and the back. Look at the back. Really cool coin. And the Washington quarter. Chris, I don't know if you have a wall. Do you have a wall with me, Chris? Or did we mail it? I'm not sure if Chris has a wallet. I will take a quick look. Up next is Coin Jeremy. You're up next. Let's see if I can go through everything here. See if I don't know if he has one. Retriever. G dub, not D dub, but G dub. I guess not, Chris. I guess whatever you had, we mailed. So if you want to mail, let me know. Or if you want a wall, I'll just put in a wallet for you. Chris. All right, so we just got a couple up. We just got um I don't haven't heard my phone call, so I don't think we've received any more donations. Just uh Coin Jeremy and Step Stacker. Pretty sure that's it. My phone's not working. Come on. One second, folks. Uh, oh, and uh, Firecrest came back with another 10 also. Okay. Step Stacker did, and then Firecrest. 10 for Step Stacker, 10 for Firecrest. All right. All right, so we are up to Coin Jeremy. He donated 10, so he gets a silver dime that does not get you a card game. 20 is for a card game. But you do get two rolls, and even for the 10, you do get guaranteed silver. You get a nice Merc dime. You get a 1941. And you do get an entry towards the one of the two jackpot prizes. All right.
right, so Coin Jeremy, good luck. He gets a member. What does he get? Eight. 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 Number eight, Coin Jeremy. Number eight. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Just missed the silver dime. Seven's the silver dime. Okay. Good luck, Coin Jeremy. Can we find you some silver? And Scott just sent a, another 20. He wants two more entries. Scott's feeling lucky. I think the last time he did it, was that mine or Sakapata? Both entries won. All right, not seeing anything on this one. So, Coin Jeremy, you know, let me know if you want whatever we get you. We got the Merc Dime. If we don't find you anything else, if you want it mailed or if you just want to create a wallet. If it's just a dime, it's just going to come in a greeting card. Mm, not seeing anything in this one. Bummer, bummer, bummer. Peppy's in the house tonight. I mean, there's more than half a box left, I think, so it's hard to say there wasn't any silver. All right, so we didn't find anything. I'm sorry, Coin Jeremy. And Ohio Coin Collecting's here. Hey, how you doing? Long time no talk. How you doing, Ohio? Ohio. Chasing 13, yeah. Good luck, right? All right, so... All right, you got your number. So let me know if you want that mail, Coin Jeremy. Just um, email me or let me know wallet or mail. So just let me know that. And we got Step Stacker. You are up, Step. Step donated 10. He gets a number. Can he get that number 13? 17. Seventeen. 17 step, let's see. 20, 19, 18, 17. Good luck, step. Can he break, can he break the silver skunk streak? You'll never know. I don't think so. An awesomely toned 74. Whoa, man, this baby's beautiful. Look at the back of this coin, Steph. Purple and gold. It's not really picking up, but beautifully toned. I don't know if you collect uh, toned coins. That's a beauty. If you collect toners. Tone to the bone. All right, one more for you, Step. What's Step saying? I got somebody's video coming in over it. Yeah, that's a nice one. All right, we received a donation from Jose uh, of Ariaga, if I'm saying that right. So he's going to get two numbers, and he's going to get a card game. Thank you, Jose. All right. Fortunately, staff, I'm not seeing any silver. Sorry about that. 
I think, I think you want that toner. I think you were saying, because that's a pretty cool coin. And you got the, you got the Merc. Thank you, Step. Oh, where are you, Step? There you are. Step's got a little wall. He's gone. He's got a quarter. He's got a, what do you got in your wall? You got a 51 Washington quarter. You got, I see a Merc dime. Another Merc dime. A 69, 40-percenter. You got the toner, that beautiful like tone 74. And a, another Merc, another 41, 41 Merc. Thank you, Steph. All right. Firecrest is up. Firecrest came in with another 10. Good luck, Firecrest. You go one more entry. Did somebody get the 13? Fifty. All right. Fifty and da, 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 let me write it down. Number fifty. Good luck. Good luck. Ah, nope, don't see anything. Sorry. One more for you. Don't see anything in this one. Sorry. You got that extra entry. Number 50. All right. So you got that. And I, like I said, I think we had that one last donation came in. All right. From Jose. Thank you, Jose. He donated twenty dollars. Okay. He gets two numbers and four rolls. Good luck, Jose. You are up. Can he get number thirteen? Thirteen. Bam! There it is. If you were starting to doubt that it was in there, there it is. Jose gets the silver render. On his very first donation. How's that for Coin Karma? How is that for Coin Karma? He gets the silver under right there. Trust me, it's silver. So he gets the silver in this week. Very, how about that? Donates a 20 and gets that number. Congratulations. Let me write that down for you. Lucky 13. So there you go. He gets one more number. He's going to get a silver card game. He's already got silver in the roll. He's got two entries to win one of those two jackpot prizes. And 16. All right. So it did go out. On the very last donator. One, two, three, four, five, six. 16. All right. We'll do that silver roll. Where is it? I'll do it last. We'll do the silver roll last. All right. So don't know if he has any friends. We don't know if we have a silver sandwich or it's the only one. We don't know till we do it. It's amazing how many of them end up on the end and there's nothing else in a row, but you never know. It could be a silver sandwich. So we didn't get skunked. I know he had silver. It was just a matter of what somebody was going to get it. And he did. Coin Karma. All right. Nothing in the first row. Let's go to a String and Sons. Two String and Sons. Then we'll do the Silver Ender roll.
<laughs> yeah, well, so you're number 13. He got it. Yeah, anything else there? Okay, no string and sons. Then we got the silver ender coming up. Dun, da, da, da. All right, I don't see anything in this one. Silver, silver ender on deck for Jose. Jose. All right. All right, nothing there. All right, so we're under time. It better be silver. I mean, it really stood out amongst all the other ones. To me, I would say 99% sure that it was silver. Um, all right, I'm, I think that might be the only one, but it, is the silver? It's a 67, 40 percenter. It is silver. So that was the ender. 67, Jose. You get a silver 40 percent half hour. You got to focus. Come on. All right. So you get that. Let me check the rest of them. I didn't think I saw anything else. Looks like that was the only one. It's amazing how they wind up on the end. That's happened quite a few times. I got a 2 out of 20 chance. All right, that was the only one. But you got one. First one of the night, and the only one on the last roll. And now he gets a card game. Jose, give me a number, 1 through 8. Got to mix these up. One through eight, give me a number, Jose, for more silver. Six, four, five, six. Good luck, one, two, three. Dime and a quarter. You get a mercury dime and a silver quarter. You got a mercury dime, a silver quarter, and a 40% half dollar, and you got two entries towards one of those two jackpot prizes. Okay, dime and a quarter. 1941 Mercury. Okay. 41 Mercury and another silver quarter. Right out of a roll from Matt Max. Nineteen, nineteen thirty-four. Wow, that's an early one. Nice, a thirty-four. Very nice. And you got the, you got the silver half dollar. You got the silver quarter and the dime. Very nice. You let me know if you want a wallet, where I keep this stuff here. Or if you want to mail it, if you want to mail it, just send me your name, full name, and mailing address. I got to make a wallet for you. I know you don't have a wallet. And let me see for your last name. Oh, it's right on the screen. Okay. All right. Congratulations, Jose. Thank you very much, brother. You got the mercury dime, you got the silver quarter, and the half dollar, the silver half dollar. Very nice. All right. Can you trade a Kennedy 
for a quarter. Uh, they don't quite have the value of that. It would have to be the dime and the and the uh, to get a quarter. To upgrade that. If you want to do that, the um, forty percent or and the dime for another silver quarter. The silver quarters are are going for about one hundred and sixty a roll now. Addicted to stacks. How you doing? Where you been? You're missing the party. We just found the first silver of the night. He just a new uh, donator. Jose came in and got roll thirteen. The silver render. He got a he got a uh, forty percenter. Yes, I'm in the quarter for. Well, which way did you want to go? What were you trying to get? Can it trade to Kennedy for quarters? Yes, the um, if you want another quarter, the uh, Kennedy and the dime for another silver quarter. Did you want to do that? I could put another quarter in there if you want to get back the the. Um, 40 percenter and the dime. So if you want to get those two back, I'll put another quarter in. Okay. Do you want to do that? Okay. So I'll give you another quarter. That's 45. Got 45 and 34. Take those back. Put the dime in there, put the quarter percenter over there, and you got two silver quarters. Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. All right. Coin Jeremy says, Maximus, the bread step has a wall. Give the dime to him. He does have a wall. Put your coin, Jeremy. Ah, uh, what do I do with it? Jose's there. What's his there? Mel, Firecrest, Silver, Dub, Chris, Scott. Analyst. All right, so I'll put that. I'll put that in Step Stacker's wallet. Okay. Where is Step Stacker's wallet? There you go. Very nice here. All right, Step Stacker, you got a Mercury Dime compliments of Point Jeremy. Thank you. Thanks, Jeremy. That would go for good use. So I was told about doing a giveaway, but making people heard back here to Max on movie night. That's right. Step Stacker is giving away a half a gram of gold, a gold bar. That's right. If he gets 50 people in the chat, not this Saturday, but the following Saturday, he's having movie night. If he gets 50 people in the chat any time, he's going to. From the comments, not in the chat, but from the comments, he's going to pick somebody, and they're going to win a half a gram of gold. All you got to do is show up and watch a movie, a classic horror movie. Last week, it was the uh, Night of the Living Dead. I'd never seen the whole movie, so it wasn't that bad. What are you showing next week, Step? All right. Money out, money in. All right, Scott. Uh, Scott Jarvey came back in with another twenty. All right, Scott, you're back up. How close are we to a third jackpot prize? Just to let you know, we got some donations in there, so let me add it up. Uh, let's see. Fifty. We're uh, we're fifty dollars away from a third jackpot prize. Fifty dollars away, but um, 
Okay. Step wants to come up. What do you want to do, Step? He wants to come up after we're done. He wants to show you something. So we'll do that before we do the uh, jackpot prize giveaway. But uh, Scott, you're back up. All right. Yeah, it's um Saturday night. Not this Saturday, but the following Saturday, right? Every other Saturday at 10 p.m. 10 p.m. Eastern. Is that right, Step? All right, so Scott donated another 20. He gets two more numbers. Good luck, Scott. 50 hours away from a third jackpot prize, if anybody's interested. 18. 18, Scott. Eighteen, twenty nineteen, eighteen. Come on, cooperate here, stay up there. Now they're gonna fall over like dominoes. Like a domino. All right. Eighteen. One more for Scott. Thirty eight. 38 for Scott. So 18 and 38. Very interesting. 38. Eight. Just missed that silver dime. All right, so we got four rolls for Scott. 18 and 38. He's got two more entries. $50 away from a third jackpot prize, if anybody's interested. Nope, not seeing anything. All right, nothing in the first row. Spring and Sons. I'm going to bring Step Stacker up after we do Scott before we do that, and then we're going to give away the two jackpot prizes. Is that okay with you, Step? I mean, are you you're going to be, how long are you going to be, Step? Because I don't want to keep people waiting too long. i got to figure out how to do it again. I can be a dinosaur sometimes. All right, nothing in that one. Two more for Scott. Come on, silver. 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 Uh, no, nope, I don't think so. Okay, nothing there. Nothing there. Scott. Scott, you get a card game. Give me a number one through eight. Another card game, Scott. What did Scott get the first time? Didn't he get a, uh, yeah, he got a walker. Can he do it again? I wouldn't be surprised. I would not be surprised. The way Scott's luck is running. I wouldn't want to bet against him. No silver. Sorry about that. Mix up the cards. One through eight, Scott. Can you give us a number yet? What's it going to be, Scott? Okay, three minutes. Okay, we're going to put Step Stacker up after this. Oh, man. Oh, cramp. Oh, geez. Cramp in the lake. Ah. Number three. Three for Scott. Ready? One, two, three. Dime and a quarter. Dime and a quarter. Where was the walker and the uh, Benji? Where was it this time? Eight was a walker and six was the Benji. Okay. Uh, 
Nine and a quarter. Uh, a 37 Mercury and a, whoa, and a really, oh, this one's got some toning on it. It's got a 45 quarter. I don't know if the camera picked it up, but that's got some toning on it. Very nice. You get Scott's wallet. Uh, let me see if I can figure out how to bring bring him up here. Because I am a dinosaur. Give me a second. Copy here. Doing it right. I put a link in the description. I clicked on two. I see it step. I got to do something else. There you go. Yeah, but I'm trying to figure out how to flip my camera. Flip it up in the air. Camera. Front camera, back camera. Oh, they got a menu set up just like the menu you get, man. How nice. So uh, that's pretty thin. Okay, go ahead. Sir. Well, I was just going to say, uh, I got this toy which looked like it was uh, spit on by about, this is a 1945, a 1945 to 1956. Uh, Hold on, we lost you. Let me make sure everything's closed. What is that? No, you, oh, it's a viewfinder. You were telling me about that. Viewmaster. Let me close out all the other windows. Oh, I don't have headphones on. I'm going to. I'm going to have to keep what are, you, what, are you, what are you trying to show us? Well, I fixed this thing, and it turns out somewhere in, like, the 1960s or late uh, early 1970s, Viewmaster put out an entire set of uh, these reels um, that cover rare and uh, ancient coins. Really? And I am going to do a video using those stills and voicing over reading out of the book lot each frame. Oh, cool. Just like you're in school back in the day. Now, what you're looking at here, this is interesting. I am going to collect the first 399 of these, and I'm going to have so many left over and so many of these. I took this thing totally apart today. It looked like a 1,000 children slobbered on it. And yeah. I, I cleaned the windows. <laughs> I mean, I did everything to it, and I'm going to do that. I'm going to take my extras. I'm going to try and put together the first 100 as many. Say maybe I can get 50 out of 100. I got these gorgeous wood boxes coming, and uh -huh. uh, I'm going to gift a couple of them. And if somebody wants to buy one or two of them, uh, um, I could actually show you. I'm going to show you. Uh, I haven't set these in. Now, now these the easiest ones to get. The reason why this is fun to collect is because – the easiest ones to get are the first 399, the original ones, which this particular one you're looking at is literally from 1946. That's when they were doing hand lettering. Somebody like uh, wow. when, you take, when you take art or cartoon classes, you have to learn how to letter. So somebody would letter it. They would turn it into a stamp 
and in, instead of uh, the you know the newer ones that had an actual typeset, this was somebody freehand writing it, and it got turned into a stamp. And this this would cost you three dollars and fifty cents, maybe even a dollar. I paid ninety nine cents for this. That's my point. This is wow. From, this is this is from like you know world. What is that? Nineteen forty six. This is just after World War II. Wow. This thing, it, I, I mean, I totally opened it up. I cleaned I cleaned the hell out of it. These things were black. These things were nasty. They were done. So, And I even sanded down those metal aluminum parts. Uh, but if, you, if you're looking on eBay for them, this part right here, let me pull it. That, that part, that metal part that's exposed, that used to be brass. So this would be a later model. This is probably from the 50s. The brass ones you can still get for five bucks, ten bucks. So I'm gonna the videos coming for that, and just this is just for the hell of it right now. If anybody wants, I got an extra one. Thirty bucks will get you shipping. If you PayPal friends and family max thirty bucks with your address, I will have this in an envelope. And, and here's what is it? That is the first. That is the, the first. I can't uh, read it. Sorry. It's the WW it Privy Mark. It's the Privy. It's the first uh, West Point quarter of the year. It's the Weir Farm quarter, and it is in the correct holder. You will see. Wow. Holders. Now here's the trick: when you're buying these things, uh, it, it may it may have a generic label, and it'll show the face of the coin, not the back of the coin. For the West Point series. You don't want that. You always want the fr you want the face of the slab to show the uh, reverse of the coin. Okay, because that's the important part. Let's see if we can get the privy mark. Probably not. The privy mark is right there next to my finger. So if anybody does want this, it is untouched by human hands, uh, except for the guy who put it in the plastic sleeve. 30 bucks to him that includes shipping to anywhere in the continental United States. It's not no big deal. It'll probably end up a giveaway in the movie night. And uh, if we get a hundred people at any time at movie night, not the next movie, but the following movie, and I'm doing them every two weeks. So it'll be a month later. We're doing a uh -huh. 3D movie. You can get the uh -huh. 3D glasses on eBay for uh, 99 cents, two pairs for uh, $2 and 50 cents. That includes shipping. Make sure you're buying it from the United States. Get the red and blue 3D glasses. I'll see you guys at movie night. The last one was awesome. Were you there? You were there, right? The movie, yes. Was it not the funnest damn thing that ever happened with the coin? It people? was. I stayed the whole time. That was my point. It's like, okay, we can hang out and do coins and do business because that's what this ultimately is. Everybody was making fun of the movie. Back in we need to have a drink together. So yeah. come down. Everybody was making fun uh, of the movie. Who's, who's going to get it next? Oh, you haven't seen nothing yet. I, I, dude, the movies that I have to choose from are so freaking amazing. And I, I'm not a monster movie guy. I'm not a sci-fi guy. I love Star Wars. Outside of that, I don't care about anything. I am so intrigued. These, these movies are so forgotten. I'm going to ask everybody in, in, next time if they want to see uh, Gold Rush with Charlie Chaplin. There is the most incredible stunt scene ever of him on a oh, yeah? real, uh, him on a locomotive racing a locomotive, jumping off the front of a running locomotive. Jeez, it is, it is the most dangerous stunt scene ever in the history. It's the most famous. It's historical, and it's ours to watch if we want to watch it. So, peace and love worldwide. Uh, stay tuned for my channel. I'll talk about this definitely during the movies. Contact me at Red Step Stack if you are interested in this. Because I'm, texture. I'm getting five of these, five hundred of these delivered tomorrow, and I'm going to have wow. a lot of doubles. And if you want to start this collection, if you do one through three hundred ninety nine, that covers everything for the United States. That was the first three hundred ninety nine, and the, all of those pictures were actually taken by the guy who started the company. He was actually the photographer. And you know what? I'm going to leave you with this right now. Just this is you, you, you're everyone in the chat is going to get the most uh, incredible feeling. Let me see if I can get it. Let me get a better one. 
Like, if you can't see how 3D it is, damn it. But the 3D quality just makes you feel like you're – when you really can see the 3D, it really makes you feel like you're six years old again. That looks pretty cool. flat. So peace and love worldwide, Max. Let's see who's going to win that coin. All right, we got a couple of giveaways. All right. All right, everybody. Thanks for hanging with me. That was very cool. All right. So I don't think I received any other donations. I'm going to check real quick. I didn't hear any any noise, but let me check real quick because I don't want to say I missed anybody. Uh, da, 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 da. Nope, we are good. Okay. And we got the two uh, giveaways. We got the Peace Tower first, and then the uh, Silver Proof Coin in the capsule, in the holder, in the velvet holder. This is a Canada Dollar 1834 to 1934 Toronto. This is a Silver Proof, half ounce, silver, silver round. Got the Indian in the canoe in the back. Beautiful coin. All right, but first up is the 1924 Peace Tower. All right. So let me get all the entries here. So everybody's got their numbers. Who's it going to be? Who's it going to be? Got a number. And the winner of the Peace Dollar is number 33. Who had 33? Thirty-three. Chris. Chris W. Chris won. All right, Chris. Chris, you just won the uh Peace Tower. Congratulations. All right, where did I put your wallet, Chris? Right here. Chris, you got the peace tower. Congratulations, buddy. He said, I did, I did. Very good. All right. All right, we got the one last jackpot. We got the silver proof round. And the winner of the silver proof round is 16. Can I get that to focus? Come on. 16. Who had 16? 16. Jose! Hey! Jose, holy moly! Jose, you just won the end of stream giveaway. Congratulations, buddy. Wow. Talk about coin karma. Comes in the nice collector holder in the capsule. You got it, Jose. Congratulations, buddy. Wow. All right. Where are you, Jose? Should be right here on top. I just had you out. Step stacker, Mel, Wesley. Where did I put you? There you are. Okay. You had the two silver quarters, and now you won the end of stream giveaway, buddy. Congratulations. Point cover, beginner's luck. Call what you want. Incredible. Congratulations, Jose. All right, we got 13 people in the chat. Let's give something away. Let's give away. Yeah, we put those over here. Put those over there. Goes back with the 
numbers. Just there. Give away Burke. Give away Freddie Mercury. In 19. Wow, what year did I say? 25. I think it says 25. Let me see if I can see it. 19. Yes, 1925 Mercury Dime. Pretty nice shape. A little bit of toning going on there. All right. Let's pull up the random comment picker. Let's see here. Go here. There. We're going to update that. All right. 31 comments. Copy link. All right. Come on, where is it? It didn't copy. Do it again. Share. Copy. Here. There we go. Unique comments, 25 unique comments. Good luck, everybody. Got to be in the chat to win it for Mercury Dime. Are you kidding me? Jose Ariaga wins again. Holy moly. He's on fire. Please mail out Scott Javery's wallet. Okay, Scott, I'll mail out your wallet. Jose, you won the dime, too. Holy moly, Scott. Or Jose. Jose wins the dime also. Wow. Jose, you better get to a lottery uh, agent. Go play some numbers. Jose wins the Mercury dime also. All right, we'll give away one Buffalo nickel, too. Where's my Buffaloes. Shuffle off the buffalo. We can only win once, though, Jose. Only once, so let's give somebody else a chance. A 35 buffalo. All right. Pick another winner. Good luck. Mike Steele. Uh, he won earlier, so Mike can't win. Uh, pick another name. We can only win once in a uh, per uh, stream. Jimmy Lakari, are you here, Jimmy? Jimmy Lakari, if you're here, say here. You got 20 seconds, Jimmy. Let me call up the clock, reset. If you're here, Jimmy, say here. Jimmy Lakari. I am here. Okay. I don't think I have a wallet for you, Jimmy. I'm going to get you a wallet. And you won the Buffalo. 1935 Buffalo. Congratulations, Jimmy. And where did my pen go? I tell you, I swear these pens are that beat and they just walk off on me. Even that one I had to go out in the uh, kitchen to get. There's like five pens in here. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. Jimmy Lacari. All right. Congratulations, Jimmy. So. All right. Very nice. Well, thank you, everybody, for your support. I really appreciate it. So I'll probably be doing a stream once a week. And like if I have time, if we do like this, I'll probably add like an auction on. I've only got uh, 15 people in the, in the chat. So if anybody's interested in an auction, put one in the chat. I'll see if it's worth it doing it. How many people would be interested in bidding on an auction?
Fire Chris wants an auction. Anybody else? We went from 16 down to 12 in a, in a heartbeat. Just two people? Well, if I only got two people, then I'm, I'm not going to do it. That would be interested in bidding on an auction. All right. Uh, well, maybe I'll have an auction in one of my streams, you know, and I'll just put it in and I'll add it in. But if I only got two people that are interested in an auction, then I'm not going to do it. Does anybody want their wallet mailed out? I know what Scott Jarvey does. Let me write that down, Scott. Mail it. Anybody else want their wallet mailed? Speak now. Okay. Congratulations, Jose. Wow, you cleaned up. I'll let you know if somebody sent me $30. D. Deb said he was going to contact you. He said he was going to text you. So I don't think anybody did. Let me look. I didn't hear any um, any any, any uh, sounder. Right now, no. Wesley says, can you mail mine? Yes, I can, Wesley. I don't blame you. Wesley says, mail it. Okay, Wesley's got a nice wallet. Let's see what Wesley's got. We got a little time here. Let's look at what Wesley's wallet. Holy moly. He's got the bicentennial silver proof set. Go on the capsules. That's a beauty. What else does he have? He's got a spinning horse. There's a walker. There's another. There's American Silver Eagle, a 2013 American Silver Eagle. Okay. I'm seeing a Benji. I'm seeing half dollars. I'm seeing some dimes. Very nice. Nice little stash. Quarters, dimes, buffaloes. Very impressive. Nice little stash. All right, Wesley. Now put the bicentennial silver proof. I got those all the coins in there, and I'll put the bicentennial proof separate, separate from them. Yeah. Okay, Wesley. I'll mail that out. Um, probably tomorrow or Friday. No later than Friday, but they will go out. What? Anybody else want their wallet mailed? Mel says, mail mine, trade up the NICs. Let's well, see what Mel's got. Where are you, Mel? Mel, 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 Scott, Jose, Mel. Let's see what Scott, what Mel's got. Uh, you don't have any NFCs, Mel. You've got a 2002 uh, proof. I think you want that, right? You got a 68, you got a walker, 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 that's four walkers. You got a Benji, this is Mel's wallet, silver quarter, 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 three quarters, a 2002 silver proof, you got a 66, 40 percenter, a Benji, a 68, 40 percenter, so two 40 percenters, one, two, three, four walkers, you've got the uh, Ngavi Rust uh, three strike error. And you got three silver quarters and a mercury dime. That's what Mel's got. Very nice. So mail, mail. Anybody else want their mail wallet? Anybody else want their wallet mail? Speak English, Jim. Yes, my first name is really Jim. I think you all know that. Uh, mail. Mail it. Mail it. So, so we got Wesley, Mel, Scott Jervy, Coin Shark from the last time. Anybody else? Mel, 
Yeah, you, I, you know, we showed it. You had quite a bit there, Wesley. Very nice. Yeah, thanks for stopping by, Jimmy. Yeah, you won. Scott wants to see what's in his wallet. Oh, you got a lot, Scott. That didn't take long to add up because I've only done three streams. Well, let's see, Scott. You have a, what is that? Oh, that's that Philharmonic one-ounce round. I must have got that from Sankapata. He had those because I'm wondering where, I don't remember where I got it. It must have been him. You got a BU-64 Kennedy. You've got a die chip over the initials, Arizona. Um, spinning horse die crack era. You've got, ooh, a Krugerin, a 2020 Krugerin. Here's a nice end of stream giveaway that you won. So that's two end of stream giveaways that you won there. Uh, let's see, let me separate it for you, Scott. You got a, whoops. Ugh. Order that one on the floor. There it is. Let me separate it all for you. Walker, 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 three Walkers. NAFC, 67. NAFC, you got two NAFCs. You got three NAFCs. You got four NAFCs. You got five NAFCs. You got five NAFCs. You want to keep those in your wallet? A 67, a 67, a 69, four 40 percenters, five 40 percenters, five 40 percenters, a buffalo, four Merc dimes, one, two, three, three silver quarters, three walkers, the Philharmonic, the Krugerin, and you got a 39. Just uh, 39 Walker. Very nice. Do I keep the uh, keep the NFCs here? A few more, and you're close to an upgrade. I love the sound of that clinging of that silver. Very nice, Scott. I assume you want to keep the NAFCs here, Scott. Uh, upgrade my NFC. Yes, or now, so I will. Just remind me. Uh, well, you only got five. Four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Right now, that would only get you like a, a 40 percenter. Is there what? At least 250. Save them? Okay. That's what I figured. Let me get you another wallet. Scott, I'll put them here. They're close. All right. Okay. Where's my paper? Scott Darby. Okay. All right, Scott, we'll put your NFC back in there. And we'll mail that out to you, Scott. All right. All right, so I think that's it. I don't see anybody else. So everybody, hey, thanks for your support. We're down to six people, so everybody basically left. I appreciate your support. Let's thank the uh, donators tonight. Uh, Mel's Coin Corner, Silver Sacks. Wesley, D Dub, Firecrest, Scott Jarvie, Nerd Analyst, Chris W, Coin Jeremy, Step Stacker, Firecrest, Jose Ariaga, who cleaned up, and Scott Jarvie again. Thank you guys so much. So, going to go down to once a week because I'm having trouble getting the coins. And, you know, it's I think it's just too much to do two, two times a week. We're not getting the turnout that I need, you know, because, you know, I've still got half a box. There's still half a box there. So, but we did give away that silver render, so that was cool. I'm glad somebody got it. So, everybody, thank you for your support. I really appreciate you hanging with me, and I'll see you on Soccer Potter stream. I went see on um, is he on Friday night? He's got a another stream. I think Friday night, right? So, 
Uh, yes, email me if you want to. Yes, msteel1990 at gmail.com, PayPal. That's my email. If you want your package mailed, Jose, just email me your full name and mailing address. Say, I want my package mailed, or did you want it mailed, Jose? Oh, I got you here. You too, Jimmy. Be safe. Everybody be safe. So email me, Jose, whether you want your package mailed or you want to keep a wall here for a couple more streams and then mail it. That's all up. That's up to you. All right. So everybody, thanks for hanging with me. I appreciate your support. And I'll see you in the other streams. So I'll be on next Wednesday at 8 o'clock. And I'll see you then. Have a good night. Bye.